All right, I have officially become Superman. I am now the bridge between two people's Xbox One and now PlayStation 4 with the Red Dead Redemption 2 bundle. And yeah, we're doing an unboxing because why not? I never really do these ever. And typically you're supposed to record opening big purchases, apparently, I think. So we're doing this. And I've been an Xbox kid since 2010. But before that, in 2005, up until 2010, I had a PlayStation 2 and I played the shit out of Battlefront, both Battlefront 1 and mostly 2, and uh, then finally got an Xbox 360, was introduced to uh, Halo outside of Combat Evolved Trial on PC, and uh, realized that I was going to have the best time gaming ever, and then I eventually crossed over to Modern Warfare 2 and the Call of Duty franchise, and then eventually Battlefield, and just basically have enjoyed gaming on my Xbox 360, up until 2014, when it was time to get an Xbox One and transition over, and uh, it's been great. But, finally, 2016 rolled around, Uncharted 4 was a thing, and then I realized PlayStation actually has really great exclusive titles. And then I was like, oh, okay, maybe I should consider getting a PlayStation 4. And then, I kinda didn't, and I've just been holding off ever since. So now, like, over two years have passed, and Insomniac Games came out with Spider-Man and I was like, oh my god, I got an hour into a walkthrough watching that game and I was like, I gotta play this for myself. And then, I wasn't really familiar with the Red Dead Redemption franchise, I didn't know anything about it. I mean, I did, I knew it was a western that Rockstar, game, you know, Rockstar made and came out in 2010, apparently it was great, never actually finished watching a walkthrough of that. I never played it for myself. And then, I finally got into Red Dead Redemption 2 and started following this game coming out and I was like, oh my god, they've been working on this for eight years and this is gonna be like one of the best games like the industry has produced in years. And I'm, I, I was like, I cannot miss out. <clears throat> I cannot miss out on these amazing titles. So, I was like, you know what? Fin finally, the, the financial opportunity presented itself and I was like, I'm getting a, I'm getting a damn PlayStation 4. So I went to GameStop. I uh, put in the pre-order, put all, I put all the money down, and then I was like, hey, I got, I'll get a copy of Spider-Man PS4 that I can't play for two weeks until Red Dead came out, and now Red Dead came out, and here we are, and uh, got the bundle. So this is, this is, this is going to be an unboxing. I've already been talking for three minutes. Thank you for still being here. Um, so, I'm the type of person who will probably accidentally show serial numbers and other stuff, so I'm going to do my best to avoid that, but uh, this should be great. Okay, so we're going to slice open the top. Sliced open the top. You see it? I did it. I probably should have, no, I guess it's probably best to slice open the top. I don't want to slice open the bottom. Um, okay, so the top opens. What do you know? It's incredible. And then uh, uh, this is going to be the most cringiest unboxing video you have ever seen. <laughs> okay, here we go. It's coming out of the casing. There's the Red Dead 2 card board. And <laughs> that comes off. It's just basically like a sleeve for the actual PS4 in here. And that's cool. It's a white box. PS4 Pro, by the way. I don't really know what the difference is between the original PS4 and the Pro. But uh, we're doing this anyway. So here we go. Um, this flap opens. Oh, man. And then uh, this opens. I bet you didn't guess that was going to happen. And I need to move this crap out of the way so that I can slide the console out. Here we go. Oh man, wires. Don't know what that's for. More wires, don't know what those are for. Got this controller. Pretty sure I'm supposed to use that to suck at whatever games I'll be playing. And then uh, got more wires, don't know what those are for. And then uh, more wires, don't know what those are for. And uh, then we go ahead and attempt to slide out the PS4 Pro. I think, maybe, possibly. Maybe not. Does it open on this side? We're going to find out. Did I mention this is going to be the cringiest unboxing you've ever seen? Yeah, I wasn't lying. Oh, I think there's a flap here. Possibly. Maybe. On this side. Are you ready? We're figuring this out together. I think it opens like this. Please open properly. I, I might have to send this back to Sony if it ever gets messed up. So I need to open this the right way. And I think... No, not like that. How does this open? Oh my god. We're almost there. 
I promise. We're getting, I might have to cut part of this. I think, I'm pretty sure this flap has to come up. There it is, it's coming up. There, oh my God, finally. Cheese. Cheese Louise. Yep, that was the cringiest thing I've said all year. Okay, there's the bot. Jeez. Oh, there's Red Dead. <laughs> there's Red Dead 2. This is cool. That's awesome, because when I got my Xbox One, I got the Assassin's Creed Unity bundle. And I know you're probably saying, ew, Assassin's Creed Unity. No, that was a fun game, man. That was, great. that was a great game. I don't care what anyone says. It was a digital copy of the game. Didn't actually get a physical copy. This is awesome. I, I totally forgot that this actually comes with a physical copy of Red Dead. Well, I didn't forget. I actually just checked a couple hours ago, but forgot in the moment. So yeah, Red Dead 2, there it is. Probably going to be the best game since Grand Theft Auto 5 because Rockstar arguably makes the best games. And there's the manual. Probably going to need that. And then uh, we got cardboard. Probably going to need this because you're supposed to keep all this stuff in case something happens. And there it is. The PlayStation 4. Oh, man. Holy crap. That's a lot bigger than the PS2. <laughs> Man, check it out. That's awesome. And I'm kind of glad that uh, this isn't themed. Like it doesn't, I'm not really into the whole like sp like red Spider-Man PlayStation 4 or anything like that. I like my consoles to be a nice neutral colored piece of hardware. So this is awesome. I know I'm weird, but uh, yeah, that was, uh, I was honestly expecting there to be a lot more. So that was, wow. This looks like it's gonna be a very straightforward setup. The Xbox One definitely has more cables and bigger cables. So uh, as an Xbox kid, this is interesting. But yeah, that is it. PlayStation 4 Pro, Red Dead 2 bundle. About to play, what will likely be, like I said, one of the best games of this generation. And it should be great. I have a cold, by the way. That's not great. But what is great, is that this video is finally over and you can leave now. Okay, bye. I have to, there's a lot of stuff over here. Like, I mean, boxes of stuff I have to take to storage. So I have to go over here and walk around through this little space and around the guinea pigs and around my vacuum cleaner and around my chair to get back to the stop button and now the video's over, goodbye. Hi, how are you?